Hey guys, so I recently just received um, my Vox Box from Influencer. It's the Estee Edit Vox Box. So I just wanted to do a quick review on the products that I received. Um, the first product was the Beam Team Hydrate and Glow. It comes in a little tube like this. And then it has, on the cap, it has like a little thing for you to highlight your cheeks. Um, so I used these a couple times already just so I could figure out how to use it and see if I really liked it before I wanted to do a review. So, so what I did with this one was I um, used the tube and I squeezed just a little bit of it on my the back of my hand and mixed it with my just regular Chanel foundation. Um, after mixing it, I just applied it on my face and just put it on like regular, how I usually put on my regular foundation. I didn't really like it because I didn't notice any difference at all um, when I used it. It didn't glow or anything. It looks exactly the same. And yeah, if anything, it made my foundation thicker. Um, it didn't make it look or feel more hydrating or anything. So I'm actually not a fan of this product. So the next one is the Flash Illuminator. Um, it comes in a little tube thing like this with a little pump. After I finished my foundation, I just squeezed a little bit on my fingertips and um, just put it on the top of my cheekbones as a highlighter. I don't know if you can tell right now, but you can kind of see it. I see it more now than earlier. Uh, so I like this product, even though I feel like it's a huge tube just for like a little highlight, but I don't really usually highlight. This one is in the color Spotlight. Next is the Pore Vanishing Stick. I looked up online and it says that you can even use this after your foundation. I, I'm not going to just because I think it would mess it up a lot. But I think it's super cute because the top of it is like white and then it has like a little bit of color in it in the middle. And I don't have like huge pores and I don't really use primer before my foundation. So I didn't notice any difference when I used this also, but I don't even know like when I put it on my hand, like if anything's even going on, cause it feels exactly the same and the product feels really dry. So it feels like nothing's even going, like it's not even moving. So I'm also not a fan of this product, but I don't know if I'm using this right or not. And then the last product I got from the Vox Box is the Barest Lip Color. This one's in the color In The Buff. Um, yeah, so it looks like this. I don't really like the packaging of it because it looks kind of old. Um, and the color is more on the brown side. And the color is okay because it's kind of natural, like just as a natural look, I like it. And I also really like this lipstick because it's super moisturizing. Um, it doesn't make my lips feel dry. It actually feels like a regular chapstick, if anything, with color. And it's obviously better than chapstick because there's it has more color. So I really like the lipstick and I really like the Flash Illuminator. I wouldn't go out and buy the Flash Illuminator because I don't really use it or need it. I wouldn't buy the Beam Team Hydrate and Glow just because I don't think it makes a difference at all. But the idea of it is pretty cool, especially with the cap thing. And the pore vanishing stick, um, if you really want it, you can go out and get it just because the packaging is really cute. But other than that, I don't like it. I'm not a fan. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this review. This is all given to me from SC Edit through Influencer um, to review uh, on my blog. So I didn't purchase these. They were given to me for review. I'm also wearing my new lashes that I got from Slashes. Um, you can find their Instagram online. It, um, it's Slashes Co. And mine are called Kukri. Use my code HOLLY20 for money off. Um, let me know if you guys have any questions. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy.